it's a unique place. <laughs> this is where we are having lunch. <laughs> where else would you have no parking your dog here sign? <laughs> That's funny. And I guess this is vital with this kind of uh, terrain. You have to clean your boots. Look at that. In Svalbard, we follow the custom of changing to indoor shoes. <laughs> and they actually have a place to store them right here. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Look at that. But it's not red. Welcome to the northernmost pub in the world. Uh -huh. <laughs> This is it. <laughs> you are here. <laughs> that is funny. Nice. Wow. Scary looking. Next to the water. <laughs> well, we can't say that we haven't seen a polar bear. <laughs> The name of the place here is called Nansen. So Nancy will, will be having lunch at the Nansen. A really nice place. Yeah. There we go. Pretty good size. Some of them can be big, but they don't have to be. The food was wonderful. Nice fresh salad, very crisp, nice, wonderful. Different kind of, uh, different kind of lux. Huh? What's the difference between these two lux? They're very different. It's a small, small, small salmon. It's a coarse salmon. A what? A coarse marinated salmon. Oh, marinated. Yeah. So this is marinated and this is small. Ah, thank you so much. Thank you. What's your name? Nitaya. You local from here? Yeah. Yeah. I work here. Living here is the ten years. Ten years. Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Oh, these are potatoes. Oh my God. Awesome. And perfect salmon. Cod. Nice sauces. Nice people. <laughs> Dessert section. Look at you. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> and this is a Vienna. A very courteous way. How many people can say they have touched the polar bear? Oh my gosh. Look how they have the chairs. I bet they are nice and cozy. It's real height. And the town is down that way. Long Yabin. I wonder what they are doing up there. Really close to the mountainside. And garbage uh, disposal is a serious business here because of polar bears. They have, uh, they have to be polar bear proof. And this is the whole town, I think. <laughs> That's downtown Longyear Beer. <laughs> and these glaciers back then, they are separate glaciers, two different glaciers. And we have the Café Bakery. Like a library or a bookstore and cafe. Yeah. This little kid is the evil carnival of Svalbard. He does really. <laughs> Oh, 
Oops. No guns. I don't know if you can see, but they have uh, antlers hanging from the ceiling. And I guess this is a cafe, chocolatier, <laughs> something. Mm -hmm. Are you going? And I guess this is a tribute to the miners. I want to watch the boat come around the corner. Okay. So that, I think I like that. I think I like that better. And would you believe these are fresh flowers? They're fresh. I mean, they have lost a little of their freshness, but they are not uh, plastic. Wow. It is rough, but it has a lot of details. Look at the cord coming down from his uh, lamp. <laughs> Everything polar bear related. <laughs> Another pub. And Svalbard Dicken. <laughs> Manholes have a reindeer. Amazing place. One of our travelers got great deals in this store. So got little sunglasses with a polar bear on the side and the beautiful scars that says with the northern lights. Look how gorgeous. Wow, really nice. Mm -hmm. I really like that. Really nice. And I guess this is pretty much the end of the, the, the town. <laughs> the rest seems to be residential. Where, where did you see the reindeer? It was just right by the bridge. Oh, by the bridge. Yes. Yeah. Oh, maybe it's still, it's still there. there anymore, but... Ah. Let me go Maybe. and check. Yep. Our first reindeer. <laughs> oh my God, I can see him. Wow. Oh, wow. Look at that. The Svalbard reindeer. Wow. He's looking at me. Look at those eyes. Wow. 
and I can hear him, I can hear him uh, munching. <laughs> it would be cool if he came up. Wow. That's a lot of fun watching him. <laughs> On the greener pastures. <laughs> have a hard time saying goodbye to you, baby. But I guess I must. <laughs> The cruise ship is coming. Mm -hmm. He doesn't have a grace. He eats a little and he moves on. Very polite. Very polite reindeer. Bye, bye sweetie pie. I think that was for the garbage collection. They, prob they probably don't remove the garbage. They probably just take the whole thing, the container. Wow, interesting. And these are all the residential. Oh, that's a smart name. <laughs> Svalbar. <laughs> I passed by it, but I didn't realize it. <laughs> interesting. The whole place is interesting. Look at all the, that building all the way down there. She's crying because her mother wouldn't let her go down the slope. <laughs> oh, the poor thing. She's crying her eyes out. <laughs> I bet she's gonna go back to the slope. very nice couple so the husband even though he's not from here he's saying the pipes are for waste and water because they cannot put them underground because of the permafrost so they have to be above ground that's what the pipes are for and we are coming back almost back to the hotel where we had lunch look at that I don't think the bikes are locked I think they're just like crazy. Mm -hmm. Nice to be in a safe town where you feel safe to leave your stuff out. I think this might be our cruise ship coming in. <laughs> the town is like towards the end, the end of the fjord, so the cruise ships do not come uh, all the way down here. So I think this is the best I can get. <laughs> pretty good actually. <laughs> I didn't think I would see it. Very nice. A new home <laughs> for the next 10 days. It's moving at a pretty good pace but it still has a, has a while to go. <laughs> and we were supposed to walk to the pier but thankfully they're gonna take us there by bus. We have to meet at the Radisson Blue, which is right there. See the garbage contain containers are on uh, rollers. They take the whole thing into a vehicle, they don't empty them here. And the houses, even though they look like they are built on the ground, they are built on stilts. <laughs> and look at the... the Arctic, what is it, puppies? Arctic puppy. 
So apparently the helicopter was lowering uh, supplies to the men up there. Connected. I wow. thought the same thing. Somebody had started connecting one. There is. That must be the team that is securing the mountain to prevent avalanches in the winter time. So that's 24 hours. Wow. You're fast. Yeah. And then, um, but like, I spent my brother's car. Well, you were in the right city. Right. So don't collapse if your luggage is not there. <laughs> we are going to pick up yet. Our we have to give some minutes to them to be working. Beautiful day to go on the ocean diamond and to begin our lifetime experience to be seeing the Arctic. In fact, our landing in Longyear Bien was great. The weather is unbelievable. We were having an extra tour in the morning that I know that for you is part of the uh, experience, but for us, usually we are not having a tour going to the places that we visit. In fact, just to let you know, in our next trip, we are not having that time because we are coming directly to the ship and we cannot visit Long Airbnb uh, because of the times of the flight. And we were having free time, we were having a tour, we were having included lunch, so that is great. And now we are going to our ship that was making a great time to get up to here. There is Yes, there it is. There it is. Woo! <laughs> yes, enjoy it. Enjoy this wonderful adventure. We are going to have an, a wonderful time with a lot of things to see, to Definitely. enjoy the deck area, the zodiac rides, to be going on the landings, to ask to the expedition staff, so don't miss any opportunity. We are going to be the seven teams with our seven trip experience leaders open for questions to be enjoying with you, to help you to recognize animals. So enjoy it really, really, really much. Great, great. Thank you. You had another question for mm -hmm. me, that it was for how long, uh, no, not for how long, how is that um, the supplies come here and how often they come? They obviously, they shift it. In some cases, depends on the urgency, they can fly them into here. Um, but then the big supplies come by ship, both ship and plane, and, and uh, it might come even uh, sometimes twice a week. We're gonna be fed, we are 170 <laughs> plus the crew. So it's about 200 people that are gonna be fed four times a day, okay, for 10 days. Four Imagine times. the amount of supplies Wait that they need. Where do you think they get it? From here, the supplies come from here because the ship arrives into Long Year BN. Well, now it's coming from Iceland, so probably we're going to eat some Icelandic tomatoes. <laughs> <laughs> so the supplies will come from Long Year BN. So, what I was telling some of you before is that every time you are going to ask for fresh pineapple, think twice. <laughs> okay, and here we are. Here we are. These are going to be our new friends. <laughs> a new family. <laughs> so any luggage is here, yeah? What did you do wrong? What did wrong? What did we do right to get set back? <laughs> we are the best, that's why we got set back. Hi, Diego. Hello. Hello. Hi, welcome. On Maggie? Maggie, yes. Maggie. Yeah. And let me see. It's Asia. Asta. As Asa. Asta. Hi. Asta. Yeah. Oh, Asta. Asta. I'm blind. Hi. Asta. Hello, Hi, yeah. thank you. Yeah. Oh, wow. Our new home. Yeah. Beautiful. This is our cabin, and we get candies, champagne, wine, <laughs> uh, nice beds, probably view. Uh -huh. It would be nice if we had the balcony, <laughs> but <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> we had some of the sweets already. <laughs> And a nice basket of fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Who is hiding? <laughs> Working on this ship for uh, 
Our uh, horse instinct this is as a team. So I know this and that about the vessel. That's why I'm doing the presentation about the ocean diamond. Um, I am from Iceland and I've been working in the expedition industry now for nine years. And I very much uh, look forward to our trips here in Svalbard. We just had an amazing, amazing dinner. And now we are preparing to sail away. Ah, we are going to circumnavigate the Svalbard. We're pulling away. Well, getting ready to pull away. Well, that is open. Certainly not polar bear proof. <laughs> the garbage. <laughs> Maybe it's not edible stuff. He just pulled the, the rope away. Mm, I'm doing it one by one. Mm, one left. We are pulling away. It started. Oh wow. I long your beer. I think this is for the garbage. Oh, we have to see that. You yellow thing, don't block my view. <laughs> We're saying goodbye to Long Year Bean. We'll be back in nine days. This is now from the other side. Down here is the airport. This is the time of the year that it never gets dark. It's called the midnight sun. The sun goes down to the horizon and then goes back up. It doesn't go, it doesn't dip down, it doesn't actually set. This is the airport, and this is the coal mining place that we passed on our tour. You might have mentioned it, but I don't remember what those, those things are, the globes. Almost out of the fjord. That's the end of it. Very nice and smooth sail away. And I guess it's time to go inside because it's a little chilly. Mm -hmm. 